Gibraltar woke up to the tragic news of the loss of a life this morning. The customs crew operating the vessel were carrying out anti-smuggling operations off Eastern Beach. The man who died was aboard another vessel. The Royal Gibraltar Police has confirmed a senior investigating officer has been appointed. The Chief Minister has sent condolences to the Mayor of La Linea and the man's family. He's promised a full investigation and has also expressed his concern about the welfare of customs officers, in particular the one officer who dived into the sea to attempt a rescue. Concerns have arisen about unrest in La Linea following the incident. Widely circulated videos on WhatsApp show riots in La Linea during the night, with police firing tear gas at the protesters. GBC understands these incidents are unrelated to the death at sea and follow an anti-smuggling operation in La Linea Beach where a rib was seized by Spanish police. So we'd heard rumours about individuals or rioters uh, targeting Gibraltarians with abuse as they cross the border uh, into Jib. So we've come to see for ourselves and uh, we spent a while at the frontier uh, talking to the people who have been there since the early hours of the morning, such as, for example, taxi drivers in the uh, taxi rank and the uh, people who run the bars and shops immediately opposite the border. And from what we hear from them, it seems to have been a normal frontier day with uh, no incidents of any kind. We've also spoken to the Royal Gibraltar Police and they've confirmed that they've received no reports of abuse or aggression towards anyone crossing the frontier today. That is not to say La Linea is a safe place at the moment. There have been threats of retribution against Gibraltar law enforcement officers from a seemingly small group of individuals on Spanish Facebook pages, as well as an audio recording circulated on WhatsApp. An internal memo to officers has been sent, advising them to remain vigilant at all times when in Spain and to consider their personal safety when conducting anti-smuggling operations on land or at sea. GBC has requested interviews on the incident, but these have not been granted, with the Chief Minister saying in his statement that the matter is now the subject of an investigation and will therefore not comment further at this stage.